welcome and welcome back to Vixie Talks, where we talk virtually about everything and live our best second life. I am, of course, your virtual boo, Vixie, and on today's episode, we're talking about prims, honey. I'm going to save you some money, and I'm going to save you some headache. If you haven't done it yet, please subscribe to my channel, text them to your girlfriends, and always bring them with you when you come here. While you're down and subscribe, go ahead and hit that notification bell so you'll be notified each and every time your boo uploads a video. Now, without further ado, let's get into this video. All right, so let's get into it, y'all. See me, I'm at the Verona. You know I love my Verona, honey bunny. Okay, this is our second floor, as you already should know. If you don't know, you better catch this video and catch up with us, honey, okay? So today, we're talking about prims. Prims, 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 prims. Everything you use in Second Life involves a freaking prim. I don't care if it's something that you got on. It's a fucking print, okay? Okay, so before we get all into the nitty gritty, honey, let me just say hey, hi, hello, hola, okay? It's been so long since I've been on this bad boy, and this video is way overdue, okay? And y'all, don't be shy. Go ahead and drop me some comments, any questions you may have about prims as we go along, okay? <laughs> Okay, so I want to share with you all my Verona penthouse too. Like I said, I love flipping penthouses and it all involves scrims, honey. I'm a clutter whore, so I like putting everything I can up in that bad boy, but I have to control myself because I know I want to leave some for my renters to do on their own. But I'm going to take you over right now and we're going to see, okay, just a little bit about what I did over there. Just a little bill that I had done. Even when you're visiting the Verona, by the way, at my door, you touch the door, you go on inside. Now with my penthouse too, okay, it's an elevator door, okay? You're entering your penthouse through your own private elevator. I love it. So without further ado, let's go take a peek inside at the bill that I did inside and be cognizant of these prints, okay? This right here is the platform bed that I did. What's well, a platform that I set the platform bed on and I enjoy making it so. Take a look. Now with bills, yeah, it's just, these are all prints. It's like blocks, okay? I'm trying to learn meshing, okay? But I enjoy building and world. Now with each one of these blocks, they are one prim each. But I'm gonna show you how we're going to link these bad boys. Let's take go downstairs and see what Vicky's up to. And let's check to see what my runners are up to. Because I gotta make sure they're okay in their straight. I'm almost available 24-7. Okay. Um, let's see. Mm. <laughs> Lord, I have to check prims. It's not a fun job. It's not exciting. Well, somebody has to do it, okay? In order for everyone to have a pleasant experience at the Verona, we have to count these prims and make sure you're staying within your prim count, okay? Because if not, there will be hella lag and hella headache, okay? Now, let's link some prims. All right, so now what we're going to do is we're going to link Prims, okay, I'm gonna save you some headache, okay, from your landlord. Because as we know, when we're renting in Second Life, all right, you're allowed a certain amount of prims. And you gotta stay within that prim count so that we all can enjoy our Second Life, okay, our experience on Second Life. So we're gonna link some prims, okay. I'm gonna help y'all stay within your prim count, honey, okay? It's a tedious job, but we want to enjoy this experience on Second Life, okay? I know y'all do not want to hear my mouth saying, Excuse me, ma'am, but you're over your prim count and you owe me some money. Your rent has increased. You don't want to hear that. I don't want to say that to you. So, we gotta link these prims. Wade, I'm sorry. Who do you think you are? Y'all, if y'all don't know, this is my pug for life, bougie, okay? Bougie baby. She has her own Instagram page, trying to go ahead over there and follow her. Mm, okay, back to me. I mean business. Mm. Alright, 
like that. So this is what y'all saw me building with earlier, okay? This is a block, a prim, just one prim, okay? What we're gonna do is we're gonna link this bad boy to another prim, and we're gonna see what it does, okay? We're gonna see how we can reduce the prim count on the two prims. So let's copy this bad boy by holding down our shift key and dragging it out from itself. Yeah, like that, okay. Mm. Keep in mind, most things in world, okay, on Second Life are convex hulls. So we're gonna change one of these prims to a convex hull and we're gonna link a prim to a convex hull. You wanna select your prim first and then your convex hull and let's see what it does. <laughs> Pay attention to this area right here on the editing tool, okay? That's going to change. What we're going to do is we're going to select each prim together. One prim, one prim, it's gonna to change to two. But when we link the two, when we select our prim and then our convex hull and link it, watch what it does. Boom, one prim. I know y'all saw that, <laughs> I know y'all saw that, okay? So now these two have become one, creating one land impact, okay? So it only has one land impact instead of two. Boom, gold. That, my friends, will save you time, money, and headache, okay? That's on the landlord end, that's on the tenant end, that's on your end, period, okay? Period. Now, what I wanna do is want y'all to come on over with me. Y'all gonna simply do this hands-on, okay? Now, there are several things you need to know also about when you're linking prims and convex hulls. Not every time it's going to reduce the land impact. And you don't wanna link anything with scripts. Anything with scripts, you don't want to link. Okay? If your bathtub, your bed, your chair that you got to sit in, anything with scripts, anything that has any kind of animations, do not link them together. I would stay away from that because you can break it. You can sit in a bathtub and end up outside. True story, okay? You do not want to link anything with scripts, okay? And it's trial and error. Take a little bit at a time. Don't go linking many, many items at one time and then it does not reduce your land impact. In fact, it raises your land impact. Now, it doesn't matter if it stays the same, that's cool. But when it raises it, then you gotta unlink all that bad boy. Listen, you don't want that headache. So start small, it's trial and error. But a prim to prim ain't gonna do nothing for you, bruh. If you do prim, convex hull, convex hull, convex hull, go. Tell me y'all, you wanna do this. Whether you be a landlord, whether you be an interior decorator, whether you be a landscaper, you want to link things to reduce that land impact. It saves you time, it saves you money, it saves you headache across the board. That's my time. Now, I would like for you all to stay with me if you'd like to. I wanna show you what I did with my penthouse one. I renovated that bad boy, okay? My tenant for a year, okay, a whole year, she moved out and moved into my penthouse two. But I renovated penthouse one, and I'm gonna show you hands-on how I link some prims and it reduce the land impact significantly, okay? And you're gonna see me do some trials and error up in that bad boy too. It's a learning experience for us all, okay? All right, so stick around if you can. If you haven't done it yet, please subscribe to my channel. Bring your girlfriends with you when you come next time. While you're down there subscribing, please hit that notification bell to be notified each and every time you upload a video. And until our next video, bye. Hey, so glad you stayed. Okay, so this is Penthouse One. Let's get busy.
we've linked a lot of prayers. We say a lot of land and pack. Let's go on downstairs. We still got some more to do, okay? Because I forgot that for you, baby. Let's go. I believe in saving time. I believe in saving money. I believe in no headaches, baby, okay? I like to save my renters money. I'm not going to put a lot of stuff up in there and charge you for every single thing that's up in there. I'm going to link that bad boy so you get to enjoy more, okay? And pay less, okay? If you ever done it yet, subscribe to Dixie Talks, okay? And while you're down to subscribing, don't forget to hit that notification bell. And until our next video, baby, bye.